Welcome to How to Expat. My name is Simon and How to Expat, we help expats relocate. And yes, the quarantine has been extended another two weeks. Uh, so now the extension is till the 25th of May. Um, if you didn't know what the what quarantine in Colombia means, quarantine in Colombia means that you cannot go out. Um, you can go out only in uh, at selected days or unselected days um, regard, in regards to your uh, ID number to go out and go grocery shopping. Uh, since around a week we can at least go out from I think 2 to 3 in the afternoon to do some sports or running or cycling or something like that. Uh, so that's really the situation here. So quite, quite harsh uh, how Colum the Colombian government handles the quarantine. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it about that. Tasha and I, we're doing good. Um, we're still working on, on yeah, achieving or um, getting some different traits. So I'm programming, Tasha is learning graphic design. So we're doing good in that matter. What's quite tough at the moment is that, yeah, the people that don't really have the possibilities to, yeah, work at the moment and they're in a difficult e economical situation right now because they can't go, go to work so they don't have food right so what we did with uh, with the fundraising we did or we still are doing the link to that is in the description down below if you want to check out what we're doing but it's it's quite tough especially in Santa Marta where uh, we work with our partner in Santa Marta that yeah kind of um, formed the task group down there to help the people the messages i get that like messages he gets from people that need help is is quite yes nothing i have ever experienced like people are really like riding in pain because they're hungry and stuff so it's very very bad the situation like i saw it like if the the quarantine had been um yeah over let's say in in a couple of days like it was um uh, programmed then i would have said it was a really really tough time and yeah like the people of course they, they used up, up all their savings and stuff and but i i think it would have been okay but like these added two weeks is really for a lot of people it's really really a big big issue um yeah that's that's pretty much what i can say about that again like if you can donate 10 20 dollars that helps out a lot already here in colombia that's a meal for for a family uh for yeah a lot of days um, we have a, a video in, in, um, uh, that we did a couple of uh, days ago or weeks ago already that uh, describes that a little bit better. But that's uh, more or less the situation here in Colombia at the moment. So yeah, I cannot really say anything. So the only thing that's changed now is not that more really more companies or, or stuff can can uh, be open so the restaurant's still going to be closed and all that stuff the only thing that happens that is different from in a week than now is that some um, some places in Colombia that have haven't had uh, coronavirus that they can start going uh, yeah uh, open up again but for most like let's say all the big cities are excluded of that it's more kind of the rural 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 areas that uh, are, are yeah that can open up again so I think it's still gonna be a big big hassle for a lot of people here in Colombia yeah other than that yeah I hope um, you are doing good uh, you're doing fine and wherever you are in the world and yeah that's pretty much the update here for in, in Colombia hope you have a good day stay safe and see you in the next one